Wait, let me Basically put camera away. Let me put camera away. No nah, witness. Bro, nigga getting executed, man. Man, publicly. Set off as a warning to the TV, man. We ain't playing with niggas, bro. We out. Not playing with niggas, man. What are you listening to? Huh? What are you listening to? Henry the Blasian. Brand new. Not even out yet. I feel alive again. I know I gotta win, and I've been on my way. Yo, what's good, HTB Familia? Welcome back to another video, man. Today, we've got a card who had a very popular Galaxy Opal, and now they gave him his endgame, man. 99 overall, Dark Matter Anthony Davis. Some people call him the brow. He's an NBA champion now. I don't know if you guys saw that one video that's been all over Twitter of him shooting Steph Curry in GTA. It was super, super funny. But uh, anyways, one of the few cards that dropped today that doesn't play the small four position, thank goodness. We're gonna see how good this card really is. See if he's gonna be worth the pickup because to be honest there's so many good cards at center now and so many good cards at power forward that anthony davis is more than likely gonna be a preference more than just the best card in the game before we get into looking at the numbers if you are new to the channel make sure you hit that subscribe button man we're trying to hit that quarter milli before the end of the month and also i want you guys to let me know in the comments do you guys still think the lakers are gonna make it far in the playoffs or even win the championship and if not who do you have winning man but uh with that being said Anthony Davis, I'm gonna see what you're all about. 99 offense, 99 defense, six foot 10, 253 pounds. Now, even though he's a center primary, I'm gonna be playing him at the four in this video just because, again, I got Shaq, I got Wilt, I got Kareem. So I'm not really looking to play this card at center. I think he's gonna be better at the four, anyways. But a uh, 92 driving layup, post game goes crazy. 92 draw foul, 96 midi and three ball, 92 free throw, 95 standing and driving dunk. Those tendencies go crazy crazy man uh he's got 86 ball handle just like his galaxy opal his defense is nuts man 97 block 98 interior 94 perimeter 88 steel i like those numbers very good rebounding very fast as well if i was to give this card any shoe it's probably going to be the kobe speed one because that's really just going to take this card over the top can't argue with 99 speed man uh 97 strength 94 lateral quickness mental game is looking good we go ahead and take a look at the tendos wow 99 everything except for on ball shot contest block and pass all that looks great and then we get into the badges 49 hall of fame badges and 19 gold i think he might come with the most hall of fame badges in the game if i'm wrong correct me in the comments but i think 49 is the most i've seen on a card so far but uh he's got hall of fame catch and shoot corner specialist difficult shots acrobat brick wall by the way his jumper is now updated to super quick instead of quick so it's mwah, 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 super green uh drop stepper heat seeker lob city finisher rim protector box clamps heart crusher interceptor intimidator posterizer rebound chaser pogo stick tireless defender and to no surprise he's also got the circus and deep threes that's one big badge he was definitely missing from the galaxy opal but now this card is juiced to hell downhill set shooter quick first step tight handles unpluckable stop and pop hot zone hunter like man the cards that have come out to start off season seven are scary i'm so worried for when we get a dark matter yao ming i don't even want to know what that card looks like but this anthony davis on paper looks amazing i'm i'm even surprised that his handles for days is only gold because at this point everybody has it hall of fame i'm not complaining about that though he still has 49 hoffs that's absolutely nuts on paper this card looks great i can't wait to see what the brow can do so without further ado ladies and gentlemen let's hop into a game and let's see what this anthony davis is really all about let's get into it all right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another HTB gameplay. And this guy's got the Anthony Davis at center. So you guys are going to be able to see both perspectives. Thon Maker's the one guarding me. Not too worried about that. We got that quick first step straight to the basket and putting it down. One thing to also remember, Anthony Davis's dribble style is on quick now. So he's going to be able to quick stop. He's got that John Morant as well. Good defense there by Thon Maker. Let's go, man. What if Lonzo was never traded for AD and they were teammates instead? Look at that pick and pop. That new jumper on very quick is so perfect. It's not like it's a stupidly quick jumper or anything. It's just so easy to green. For whatever reason, it made the green window on it so much bigger. I want to try to see if I can pull off the post spin of hell on this guy. All it takes is one crossover. Boom, got him. All the way and put it down. Look at AD, man. I love how Anthony Davis cards play every single year. I don't know what it is, but he always plays so good, especially defensively. This card is always cracked. His Anthony Davis isn't really giving us issues, and that's why I got Shaq at center, man. That rim protection is just different. Back to Lonzo. Pump fake. AD in the corner. That's not a green, but it's a bucket, baby. 
Let's go. One thing I will say, using AD at center is definitely a good advantage on offense because it's it's hard for Shaq to even keep up. I'm not going to lie to you. That's a little pick and pop. Oh, yeah. They're not looking at it. Look at that beautifulness, man. We got takeover sharpshooting. Pump fake. AD's cutting through. I got that takeover. I'm trying to go into the post fade. Why not? Why not show it off a little bit? Contested, man. Hey, I'll take it. It's stupidly fast. I honestly don't even know if he needs a speed shoot. He be moving so quick. Look at this. Stopping. Oh, yeah. I'm pulling that three. Thank you so much for that space, Don. You got to be careful, man. This guy's not playing the craziest defense. We're cooking. Get in the post. Get in the post. AD in the corner. Pump fake. Oh, I thought he'd jump at that. Cross it up. Thank you. See you later. Straight to the basket and putting it down. Now, his quick first step is different. Look at AD being the one to call for screens. Nice little crossover. Thank you. Inside to Shaq. See, this is the thing about AD. You're not big enough to guard someone like Shaq. I can do that literally all day on Anthony Davis because it doesn't matter. At the end, you're still 6'10", man. Give me a nice little ISO. This is a nice little mismatch. Get me in the post. Get me in the post. I love being able to score in the post when I get the chance. Oh, yeah. Just drop step that. That should be an easy and one. Big boy and one. That's things you love to see, man. I'm sorry, Ja. I didn't want to do you like that. I am excited to see that Dark Matter at work, though. I can't wait to try that card. For now, though, we move. We got to keep moving. T-Mac, why are you running into people's bodies? Are you good, my guy? Hit that screen. Thank you. Open three. I got to pull for something. That's a green. I'll take it. T-Mac is moving different right now. Let's see if I can hit this guy with a post move of death again. Got him. All the way. Oh, never mind. Oh, oh my gosh. You know what? Let me continue the game. I feel bad for the guy. I feel bad. He can quit the game himself. Yeah, I will let you exit. I will not exit for you. Anthony Davis. Let's hop into another game, man. Wait, is this the same guy? Oh, no. This is another guy using Anthony Davis. Okay, that works for me. Oh, he's got Ben Simmons at point guard. Yeah, definitely a tougher matchup. Nice blow by there for AD all the way through and putting it down, man. Let's get to work. We're definitely going to have to take this guy seriously because his lineup is definitely scary, man. Once again, Thonmaker is the one guarding us, but we got that off-ball deodorant. I'm blowing by, though. People always expect a jump shot. No, sir. Put it down, AD. Easy twos. Hit that screen. Curry side. Thank you. Too much space there for Mr. T. Makalaka. Three to the dome, baby. Throw it to me. Throw it to me. Throw it this way. Throw it this way. Good defense there, AD. Touchdown pass. Right to Thon. In transition. Put that down. We'll take those, man. We'll take those. All right, boys. We're in the second quarter. Now it's really time to step it up. Oh, yeah. We got a lane right there. Grand Tills taking that all the way. Reverse dunk style. We like that. All right. Let's get some stops. Throw it to me. Throw it to me. I saw that. Thank you. Easy bait. Now let's run with it. AD in transition all the way through. Putting it down. Oh, my goodness. This guy is making me work for my buckets. I am not letting Chris Bosh guard me. I hope you know that. Hit that screen. Thank you. I'll keep going for twos. He doesn't want to give up a three, but if it means I take more twos, that's fine with me. If I can't shoot from half court, let me at least try to get him open. He's reading that off-ball deodorant, though. Oh, he's not. I'm way too open. Green bean, baby. Greens. What is Lonzo doing right now? Oh, that's a finesse. Thank you. Stop in. He's behind me. That's a green. Lonzo ball finessing that pick and roll beautifully. Let me see if I can get Rudy Gay involved here in a pick and roll offense. Oh, yeah. Keep hitting those screens, man. Leave me wide open. Leave me open, man. You got to close out on those. We're in the second half, man. Let's get to work. Nice little curry side. Oh, AD. Pick and pop. That's a green. Thonmaker sagging off for what? The only thing that really concerns me about AD is the fact that he doesn't have any rebounds yet. Oh, KD is getting clamped right now by KPJ. Spread the floor. Thank you. Right to AD. Easy lane right there. And put that down. Thank you very much. Go for the alley-oop. Go for the alley-oop. We got two seconds. One. Oh. Let's go, bro. Let's go. Give me an ISO, man. I'm not scared of Thon Maker. All I need is one Hezo. Like, he's so fast. It's crazy. Beautiful behind the back into a Euro step. A. Hey, got him. Don't jump too early now, son. Don't jump. Get in the post there, AD. You got that post hook. People always jump a little too early. What did I say, man? Don't jump too early. There we go. See, now we got that momentum. Read that pass. Oh, there we go. Nice bump by AD. And we got takeover. If I can get a nice little stop. He's got Danny Ferry on me. But Danny Ferry, that man is so season six. Hold that screen. Pump fake. Oh, I could have shot that, actually. Let me get right back to him. I'm pulling from deep. Why not let it fly, baby? Oh, my God. Good deep. Yo, look at AD with the bump steals right now. What is going on? Go right out for three. Thank you. Dimer me mama green bean. So guys, we're in the fourth quarter and guess what? AD still doesn't have a single rebound. Can I do the move? Got him. Thank you. The spin move of hell. Look at, oh, I just traveled there. I just traveled so bad. I just did a double spin. But uh, yeah, Anthony Davis doesn't have a single rebound tonight. That's a little bit concerning. He does have four steals. Let me see how he can defend in the paint though. Because this is what I plan on doing if I see AD at center. Every single time into a post hook. Look, he can't stop it. You just can't. 
I'm still trying to put on a show here, AD. You're not done, man. Oh, Ali, you that. Oh, my boy's got that vertical, though. Sheesh. Let's run a nice little play here for AD. There we go. Now get off that screen. Thank you. Pump fake. Oh, he jumped at that. I'm drawing a foul here at the least. No foul? Okay, I'll take the contact layup. Sheesh. I'm actually shook that AD is going to go a whole game without one rebound. That's crazy. Where do you think I'm going? Thank you. I'll take the left blade into a Euro step. Nice finesse into a dunk. Unstoppable force of nature right now. And just like that, man, our opponent has left the match. Only a minute left in the game. Now, he did hop on the mic and he did say GG and he was actually a humble guy. So, GG's my guy. I do wish you stayed in the game though because I kind of want to see the box score. But uh, let's hop back into the main menu and talk a little bit more about this card. So, as you guys were able to see, man, Anthony Davis, a force of nature, and he's definitely going to be one of those top tier cards in the game. Now, whether you play him at center or power forward, honestly, it's going to be up to you. I low key think you actually get more of an offensive advantage with him at center more defense at power forward but again it comes down to your play style all around though this card's a demon would i say he's the best center in the game no would i say he's the best power forward in the game also no but he's just that card that plays so well like defensively his awareness is so perfect even though he didn't have any rebounds that game i'm gonna let that slide because that's one of those things that just isn't gonna happen every game one thing he did a lot that game though was get a bunch of steals that's why i want to see the box score so bad because just from the steals I counted out alone he had five steals so to see the total would have been insane but this card all around man he really is damn near perfect aside from the fact that he can't quote-unquote curry slide and you really don't need the curry slide to get buckets as you guys were able to see because his quick first step is something nasty now I would definitely recommend you go ahead and give him a speed Kobe Grinch because he really doesn't need any of the other ones you don't really need to soup up his defense anymore it's perfect his three-pointer it's at a 96 no point in wasting a shoe to go up by three. Coaches are going to do that for you already. And yeah, man, you get that speed up. And then when he has 99 speed and 96 speed with ball, then people really got to be scared because he was moving out there and he only had 91 speed with ball. And that for a big man is just something you really don't want to play around with. He's definitely going to be a top tier big man in the game. I don't know where I'd place him as far as a top list because I'd have to go ahead and look at all the other cards, but he's definitely up there. A lot of people are going to be using him at center more than power forward because they want to be more offensively cheesy. But this card all around a damn bucket and you will not regret adding him on your team i can't wait to get lebron james and get that dynamic duo gameplay going for you guys one quick thing i will say though guys is that i will take anthony davis over any other dark matter power forward like kevin garnett blake griffin chris bosh anthony davis is definitely the top one as far as that goes will he be worth picking up that's hard to answer because again we just got a jonathan isaac and thon maker in the game so depending on what price he settles at he is or he isn't going to be worth picking up but uh with that being said guys this is going to be the end of the video if you guys did enjoy the video don't forget to leave a like and for you new viewers you know you gotta hit that subscribe button and join the blazing nation i want to thank you guys for watching i hope you all have an awesome day and take care